This recording details how to sell seats and view sell responses using Travelport SmartPoint. Selecting the seats you wish to sell is simple with SmartPoint. Let's start by bringing up an availability display. We will use the Air Availability Search fill-in format, which you can access via the search option of the toolbar. We'll look for Paris to Barcelona from the 6th of January until the 13th of January. At this point you could select the number of passengers that you'll be selling. Then click on search. The terminal window will now partition, showing the outbound sector in the top partition and the return in the bottom partition. If we hadn't already done so, we could select the number of passengers travelling from the modifier toolbar. I'll adjust the number of passengers to 1. When you adjust the number of passengers on the upper partition, you'll see that the lower partition changes accordingly. To sell seats, simply click once on the required booking class from each sector. The sold seats will display in the PR Viewer window on the left. As with many SmartPoint screen responses, information is colour coded. To explain these, Clicking on the line numbers, shown here in green, would give easy access for booking cars and hotels. The city and dates are pre-populated as per the information in the flight itinerary. The booking class code, also shown here in green, would give access to the relevant seat map for that class. There is a key at the bottom of the screen to explain the colour coding of the seat map. To assign the seat, hover the mouse over an available seat and left hand mouse click. The assigned seat will now show in the relevant sector. To select seats on the return flight, highlight that sector and again choose an available seat from the map by left hand mouse clicking on the seat number. Once seats have been assigned, you could then click on apply. Flight numbers shown here in blue will give details regarding flight service information. So here we can see that on this flight, breakfast or a snack is served, flying time is 1 hour 40 minutes, and the flight departs from Charles de Gaulle Terminal 2F and arrives into Barcelona in Terminal 1. To close this, either click on the E or click on the flight number again. By clicking on the airport codes, detailed airport information can be accessed we can click on MD to move down to read more information. Hovering the mouse over the booking status codes gives a description of their meaning. So for example, HS have sold, inventory adjusted. When there is information given about a particular flight, such as terminal information and APIS reminder, it is possible to clear this by clicking on close. We will now take a look at another availability. In this example, we will look at a return flight with Singapore Airlines from London to Denpasar. If there is a connection and the same booking class is required from each sector, double click on the booking class code to sell the entire routing in the same class. To select a different booking class code of a connecting flight, Click once on the desired class from each leg. Once classes have been chosen from all legs, the cell results will display in the PR Viewer window. Let's take a look at another availability, this time from London to Delhi. Seats that are on request or available to waitlist are displayed in the colour orange in the availability display. From a booked itinerary, when we hover the mouse over the LL code, we can see that this indicates that this flight is on waitlist request. Let's take a look at the status code in a booking which has been ended. We can now see that it's HK, and when we hover the mouse over this, we can see that it means confirmed. 